Let's take a look at how we can compare against types with our variables in PowerShell. So I have a variable defined up here and a couple of if statements. And you'll notice that I'm using something that um, looks like a comparison operator. It's the is, and when I run it, it allows me to compare against these types. So there's different types. There's int, there's strings, there's array, um, there's a bunch of different ones. And by using is, we can compare against them. The equals will not work. Uh, so let's look at something else we can do. If I change this, it'll now validate as a string. If I add another item to it, you'll see down here, it's now validating as an array. And if I know something's an array, then there could potentially be more items in there. So I have another nested if statement and I'm checking to see if the second value in this array is an integer. And it's not an integer in this case, so nothing was displayed. But if I make it an integer, which that is not, now you'll see the second if statement is executed. So by using the is, we can compare against types in PowerShell and run code based around that. And that's it. Thanks for watching.